Alright, welcome back to another secret, super, I don't know, super secret, whatever you call these type of episodes where I just do them for subscribers. Well, it's kind of secret anyway, there's a there's playthrough that's, it's pretty much a playthrough that's unlisted on YouTube. But we saw from last time that the crow here, it's a bit too slow to get us. Let's just bring it over here. Oh my goodness, is it actually going to get us? Okay, no. So Moon Earth, a crude astronomical poster. Machine has a password input. It probably controls the rightmost doors. There are eight digits in the password. You haven't got a clue of what it might be. Okay, so there's probably a tip here that will probably be going to this door. Yep. Seems like everyone likes to lock doors here. It does seem like that. A tired old potted plant. Maybe there's something behind. No. Oh my goodness. No, don't get me, crow. <laughs> The, I swear it was like, it's like the opposite of moon, I don't know what that might be, or earth. Moon. Maybe it's that. Okay, it is. Because um, the M is the 3 and the 2 is the N. Even though I don't, I actually, yeah, because plan is 1. So now we're here. What happens if we touch this? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've transferred, haven't we? Oh goodness, um, yeah, I'm gonna, we're gonna see that a lot. Where I'm gonna deliberately, accidentally, you know, lose the game. What's, actually, that's probably gonna be the same. So the shadows trans... I walked into that, didn't I? Oops. Oh, it's a different one as well, if you go into the white. We just turn into these, like, little cum demons, I guess, you could call them. Oh gosh, no, I should stop sprinting. And I say that, but it moves twice, okay. Wonderful. I really love RPG Maker controls. <laughs> I do, can you press on the ground? No, you can't. In RPG Maker MV, they have a thing where you can press on the ground and it will make you move. I like the sweeping bots. A sweeping robot, the wheels are broken. Oh, I can't fix it, can I? That would be a nice easter egg to have in the game. I guess those things, like, slowly chase me. Let's save here. Oh! The thing is trying to open the door. It doesn't look like you could outrun it forever. Your best shot is to find a hiding place quickly. No! <laughs> okay, this is this is the part where I really, really falter because um I'm not great at making quick, ready decisions. See, I'm not great at sprinting. And of course, the thing gets me instead. <laughs> oh, wonderful. That's, um, that's, that's what I guess this game is can- No, I wanted to go on the other side. My goodness. Oh, okay. Let's see if we survive this. No, you can't see me, can you? Oh, be scary if it came back in. 
Okay, now I know how to kind of survive here, because I've died twice to these annoying things that... I didn't even touch it that time, come on. <laughs> At least I saved so I don't have to do that horrible chase again. What? It just teleported onto me, come on! Come on, seriously! So they eventually try and come down, don't they? They're go it's gonna go up. Yeah, I can't do anything about it. Oh, come on. I wish it was random, but no, it just seems to be chasing me. Come on. <laughs> oh, this is worse than the chase that I had before. Okay, good, good, good. Now I hope I don't mess up by accident. Okay, now just save. And you just watched that all happen as I was getting chased by that big thing. Wow. Thank you so much, Pure. You're very loyal. Please don't be afraid of me. I'm not going to assimilate you. I'm not the same as them. Please rest assured. You must have seen the hint I posted on the wall. I know that humans must be very smart and excellent creatures. If you're human, then it would be easy to get here. I know that it's been hard, but thank you for coming here. Please rest for a while. Do you want to talk? Suddenly, I'm feeling a little nervous. You're actually in, probably more nervous than he is. But maybe he knows the code. It's probably a good idea to ask him about the place. We have metabolic needs too, so do please don't eat any food. Get your own food if you're hungry. Mountain of books. I wonder if I can go on to any of the images. Strange paintings. Please don't stir at them. Oh, wonderful. Wait, what? Seriously, right in front of me? Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, I mean, you're, it's a fairy playing the game, so you, you've kind of got to expect that, can't you? Alright, I just won't let me skip. Alright, I guess we could talk with him. Good, I'm glad you didn't run away or throw anything at my face. As you can see, I'm a so-called monster. Just a normal, nothing special monster wants to be better. Actually, I'm no different than those things that you've seen before that want to transfer you, so, in fact, please do not fall on me. The consequences are very serious. Well, I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Puro. I'm a back latex monster. If I have a gender, I think I would be male. I guess you were the one who was locked in that room. I'm not very good at writing, but I hope the hints I wrote helped you understand the situation better. I wrote it up and posted it on the wall, so are you disappointed? The one who led you here isn't human. However, humans are still an excellent species. You really made it. You came all the way by the library by yourself. Sorry, this place is a mess. I haven't cleaned it yet. It must have been the power failure that made your capsule open. At that moment, I realized that you were finally going to wake up. I've never had a conversation with anyone before. No one else speaks here. I might be bad at it, but I will try my best to answer your questions. It's a great honor to have a conversation with a real human. I've studied here for ages, probably for this very moment. It's a great honor to talk with the species who created us. So what do you like to ask? How can you talk? Incredible, right? I was the same as those dark creatures you saw outside. Until one day I came into this library, and took an interest in the books and the language you humans created. It was strange, but I started to look at these books filled with strange symbols and pictures. It fascinated me. I read as many as I could and eventually started to notice the patterns, repeated words and labelled pictures. But I'm the only one who had the desire to learn. None of the others had the same interest in studying. I surprised myself that I learned to talk. Studying this was super hard, but I won't really want to improve myself. 
Human language culture and entire world fascinated me so much. It'd be awesome if I was a human. At least I learned to see better without motion sensing, but it's still challenged for me to read. Yes, my species was created from a failed sample that humans produced, so I know I'm naturally weak. But I have also read that humans used to be very weak as well millennia ago. Maybe there could be a high IQ creature like me who could lead, kind of lead, build their own civilization like humanity did. I know it sounds stupid, but no matter what happens, I still want to give it a try. I tried to better myself because I want to be kind. Kind of to be better. I didn't want my kind to be doomed to failure and extinction. I want to be better. I believe you've already seen those impressive crystals on the way here. When we die, our bodies dissipate. Only this might mask remains. After our mask falls to the ground, it sprouts the same type of crystals which you saw on the way here. The crystals break eventually, producing new cre creatures. Sometimes a few of them turn out to be different than the rest of them. I am one of these. The ones that can fly, and that big guy that are evolved more than most. Normal ones like me were made with wolf DNA. Successful, we were the first samples they ever created by the way. The white latex creatures were the next ones created by them, better, smarter, improved. But as far as I can see, white latex still can't talk. So it's still better after all, haha. <laughs> white latex have more stale body structures, they can't change nearly as much. Actually, this means I'm pretty lucky after all, but I could improve even more if I gain a human host. Do you want to be transferred? Never mind, I'm kidding. So what would you like to ask? It was a long, long time ago I went upstairs to try and find more information about the world, though I discovered info that said that there's still humans in one of the capsules. Then I found you in the room you were locked in. I wrote all the clues I could think of that could help you lead to me. If you don't get out of here quickly and stop, keep wandering this building, you'll be transferred by those latex creatures. My original plan was to use the last human as a host, and I could be better, stronger. Even though you're, you've been kidnapped, it may be a blessing. You missed the plague outbreak and survived. I don't know whether you call that unlucky or unlucky, but now I'm sure you're the only human in this building. I never left the building, so I'm not sure how it is outside. Where did the humans go? You might have to prepare for the worst, same for me. You're so weak and thin. I'm not interested in you for now. You don't have to worry. This is a hard question. I never think of these kind of things. It's been so boring that there wasn't anyone I could talk to. It is horrible that no one could understand me. But for now, I was planning to lead you here and use you, you as a host. But now I've changed my mind. I'll watch you for now. However, it's very boring here. Please let me talk to you a little more. Maybe I can help you with something. To study humans, it must be an interesting thing to do. Alright, I'm gonna see if there's anything thingy. I'm gonna save the game in case they gave me some friendship points. I guess you call them that. I don't also want to continue those conversations and redo that because it's like five minutes. There are latex beasts over there, are you sure you want to go in? Do I still have to continue talking to him? If you want to keep searching this building and escape, you must overcome lots of dangers. But if you made it this far, that means you've got what it takes to escape the building. Lots of doors in this building are closed as well. The doors are sturdy and most of them have passcodes. Not even I could get through them. Like the room you were locked in. Try keep going. I can't help you escape, but if you have any questions, please ask. It's still dangerous for me to search around the building. The door next to the moon poster, so the fi human finally needs some help. But you shouldn't try and find the password by yourself, really. You're just asking me right away. I was expecting that you could figure it out but yourself, but I guess this is a really hard one. The password is triple one zero triple zero double three. Do not forget. Alright. I guess we'll go over there, place the password in. Okay, good. That thing did not transfer me this time. Oh no. <laughs> oh no! I'm gonna have to reset the zone. <laughs> that was so stupid of me. There we go. Everything's better now. Alright, let's save and we can go through the thing. I do want to see if there's any photo sets nearby. Okay, it's too slow to get me, which is great. 
I think that thing's gonna follow me again. Please tell me it's not. Oh, what's this? A device to control the gate of the library, you opened it from the other side. Oh, no. Looks like the door is blocked by latex, maybe you should go back. No, not you again. I already hate you so much. <laughs> There's a photo set though I want to check out though. Before I end off the video, I'm just going to go to it. I know I might get transferred by the big thing, but I do want to see the photo set. I can't go that way, can I? Of course, I do that. I tend to do things like that often. <laughs> okay, let's go. I just want to see the photos. Is it really that much hard to ask for? Okay, there's more important things than being transferred. So they've got two people there. They're looking at the sample. And it goes in the face, and oh my goodness, they get transferred. And I get transferred too! Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe, send advice in the comments section, and I'll see you all next time for the next changed video. Bye bye